If you're a diabetic, you know how important it is to be mindful of your diet, exercise regularly, and monitor your blood sugar levels. But have you ever thought about the role that minerals play in managing your diabetes? Yes, minerals are essential for overall health and well-being. But did you know that some minerals can be particularly beneficial or harmful for diabetics? In this video, we will talk about the worst minerals for diabetics, so make sure to watch till the end. But before we continue, if you appreciate all the information and the research that goes into making a video like this, it does help out tremendously if you hit the like button or hit subscribe. Thank you, and let's begin. Before we dive in, let's remind ourselves of the crucial role minerals play in our bodies. Minerals are inorganic substances that our bodies need in small amounts to function optimally. They are involved in various processes, such as maintaining fluid balance, strengthening bones, and supporting the nervous system. While there are many minerals that are essential for good health, some are particularly significant for diabetics. Now let's start with the best minerals for diabetics. Magnesium is considered one of the most critical minerals for people with diabetes. It plays a crucial role in insulin sensitivity, blood sugar regulation, and reducing inflammation. Research has shown that people with diabetes often have lower magnesium levels than those without the condition, and this deficiency has been linked to poor glycemic control. A study published in the Journal of Clinical Endocrinology and Metabolism by Rodriguez Moran et al., 2003, found that increasing magnesium intake through diet or supplementation improved insulin sensitivity and glycemic control in individuals with type 2 diabetes. Foods rich in magnesium include leafy greens, nuts, seeds, and whole grains. Another essential mineral for diabetics is chromium. Chromium is a trace mineral that helps to enhance the action of insulin, the hormone responsible for regulating blood sugar levels. A study published in Diabetes Care by Anderson et al., 1997, found that chromium supplementation improved glycemic control in people with type 2 diabetes. Additionally, low chromium levels have been linked to an increased risk of developing type 2 diabetes. Foods high in chromium include broccoli, green beans, whole grains, and lean meats. Zinc is a vital mineral for diabetics, as it plays a role in insulin production, storage, and release. Research has shown that zinc supplementation can help improve blood sugar control in people with diabetes. A study published in the Journal of Clinical Biochemistry and Nutrition by Seat et al., 2011, found that zinc supplementation improved fasting blood glucose levels and insulin resistance in people with type 2 diabetes. Foods rich in zinc include seafood, lean meats, nuts, and seeds. While these minerals are particularly beneficial for diabetics, there are others that can have adverse effects on blood sugar control and overall health. The first of the worst minerals for diabetics is sodium. While sodium is essential for maintaining fluid balance and nerve function, excessive sodium intake can lead to high blood pressure, a common issue among people with diabetes. According to the American Diabetes Association, diabetics should limit their sodium intake to less than 2,300 mg per day to reduce the risk of hypertension and other health complications. A study published in the Journal of Hypertension by Suckling et al., 2016, showed that reducing sodium intake in people with type 2 diabetes helped lower blood pressure and improve cardiovascular outcomes. To minimize sodium consumption, it's essential to avoid processed and packaged foods, which are often high in added sodium, and opt for fresh whole foods instead. Another mineral that can be harmful to diabetics is phosphorus. Phosphorus is essential for bone health and energy production, but excessive phosphorus intake can lead to kidney damage, especially in people with diabetes. According to a study published in the American Journal of Kidney Diseases by Chang et al., 2011. High phosphorus intake is associated with an increased risk of kidney disease in individuals with type 2 diabetes. To limit phosphorus intake, diabetics should be cautious about consuming too many foods high in phosphorus, such as dairy products, nuts, seeds, and some types of fish. Lastly, iron is a mineral that can be detrimental for diabetics when consumed in excess. While iron is essential for oxygen transportation and energy production, High iron levels have been linked to insulin resistance and type 2 diabetes. A study published in the journal Diabetologia by Montonen et al., 2012, found that higher iron levels were associated with an increased risk of developing type 2 diabetes. Furthermore, excess iron can lead to oxidative stress, which can contribute to the development of diabetic complications. One reason for the negative impact of high iron levels is that iron can accumulate in the liver and pancreas, 
organs that play critical roles in blood sugar regulation. This accumulation can lead to impaired insulin production and action, ultimately contributing to poor blood sugar control. To avoid excessive iron intake, diabetics should focus on consuming a balanced diet and be cautious about taking iron supplements without a doctor's recommendation. Foods rich in minerals. Nuts and seeds are packed with an array of minerals, but are particularly rich in magnesium, zinc, manganese, copper, selenium, and phosphorus. Whole nuts and seeds make a convenient, nutrient-dense snack, while nut and seed butters can be incorporated into smoothies and oatmeal, or paired with fresh fruit or vegetables. Shellfish, including oysters, clams, and mussels, are concentrated sources of minerals and are packed with selenium, zinc, copper, and iron. Consuming six medium-sized oysters, 84 grams, covers your daily needs for zinc and copper and provides 30% and 22% of your daily needs for selenium and iron, respectively. Eating cruciferous vegetables like cauliflower, broccoli, Swiss chard, and Brussels sprouts is associated with numerous health benefits, including the reduction of chronic disease. These health benefits are directly related to the nutrient density of these veggies, including their impressive concentration of minerals. Eggs are often referred to as nature's multivitamin, and for good reason. Whole eggs are rich in nutrients and provide many important minerals. They're high in iron, phosphorus, zinc, and selenium, as well as many vitamins, healthy fats, antioxidants, and proteins. Beans are known for being packed with fiber and protein, but they also happen to be an abundant source of minerals, including calcium, magnesium, iron, phosphorus, potassium, manganese, copper, and zinc. Adding cocoa to smoothies, munching on a piece of dark chocolate, or sprinkling your yogurt with cacao nibs are satisfying ways to increase your mineral intake. Magnesium is needed for energy production, blood pressure regulation, nerve function, blood sugar control, and more. In conclusion, minerals play a crucial role in managing diabetes and overall health. While some minerals like magnesium, chromium, and zinc are particularly beneficial for diabetics, others such as sodium, phosphorus, and iron can have adverse effects when consumed in excess. By examining the studies mentioned, we can see the significant impact these minerals have on the health of individuals with diabetes. To ensure you're getting the right balance of minerals in your diet, it's essential to consume a variety of nutrient-dense foods, including fruits, vegetables, whole grains, lean meats, and low-fat dairy products. It's important to note that individual needs may vary, and it's always a good idea to consult with a healthcare professional before making significant changes to your diet or taking supplements. By being mindful of your mineral intake and making informed dietary choices, you can take control of your diabetes and work towards better overall health. Remember, a balanced diet, regular exercise, and proper monitoring of your blood sugar levels are the keys to managing your diabetes effectively. Stay informed and make smart choices for a healthier, happier life. Thank you for watching today's video. Please like, share, and subscribe for more informative content about diabetes and nutrition. Stay healthy and take care.